What is up guys? Mazarubo here, also known as John, and I welcome you to an exciting new Wound Star Defense Battles and BTD5 YouTube channel. Um I'm just gonna go ahead and hop on in here to some battles play before I finish my introduction, just so you guys don't have to wait too long, alright? Um now this is my first video here on YouTube, so if you're watching this, congratulations, you have found it. You have found the very first one, the Primario Uno. Um, and so, thank you guys so much for watching. So, anyway, uh, more on the introduction later. We're going to have to focus right now on gameplay. We're going to be playing Swan Lake, which is a new map, and some people find it fun. I find it terrible, uh, mainly because it sucks. Just It's terrible. It's just, just guys, it's... It's like the land portion is so hard to actually use. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something funky. Just like something different. Let's go darts, banana boats, and wizards. Maybe not darts. Let's go. Uh, yeah. Ninja. Just in time. Ah. Ugh, okay. So I had a hard time deciding there. I'm not going to go banana farms just because. I probably should. But oh, we got the mortar. That's pretty terrible. Uh, and let's go for... A sub. We're gonna go. So he's also going to go with looks like Blue Nico. All right, so this could be fun—a Blue Nico battle, and it's not something you get to see every day. Um. So anyway, guys, for those of you who don't know who I am, I have had a couple of YouTube channels before, just some smaller ones on different subjects. But I have. Um. If you are unfamiliar with me, I am a college student right now. So that's right, I'm a college student. Because this is this is hardcore right now. Uh. That's what I don't like about the sub. It's kind of hard to start with uh, against Plunico. But, um, I am a college student currently in the accounting uh, major field. So, um, it's working out pretty well for me. I'm enjoying that. If you don't know what accounting is, it's basically what businesses use to, um, well, what battle energy? No, man. Don't, don't do battle energy right before the blues come out. Uh, whatever. Follow me. Uh, anyway, so it's like what companies use to uh, basically record like where their money goes. So you know they'll have a purchase or something, and they they will have to record like wh who who got paid, when did they get paid, and so on and so forth. So uh, that's what the accountant's job does. So, no, not a little red balloon. So he's gonna have to, he's gonna have to balloon boost already. Um, kind of sad. I'm just gonna keep sending eco. I don't I don't really care. Uh, and, um, actually, you know what? Oh, screw it. I'm going to save up a little bit of cash here. I'm actually going to go ahead and put this guy down right here. Just going to put him on 1 1. Uh, actually, no, screw it. I'm just going to leave this guy there and I'm going to go for a bunch of yellow or a bunch of greens. Boosted, hopefully, to get him to, uh, to use his last boost. So here we go. Let's go for a bunch of greens. Let's see what he's going to do. Is he going to use his third and final boost? I don't know. I hope so. He probably shouldn't. Just a few lives, right? So, um, this is gonna cause him some mass cast. Come on, boost, 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 boost. This isn't gonna kill him, is it? No, it's not. He's gonna, he's gonna survive with a few lives. And he... D what? Why would you use your boost to save, like, two lives after... Oh, my. Alright. So, what are we gonna do? Basically, I think I gotta get some, uh, some sort of sub up. Uh, it'd be nice if I could have it actually before my nuclear sub, I think. I can have my airburst starts before my nuclear sub, so I'm gonna put this guy right there. Boom, boom, boom. Um, I'm not gonna try to kill him with the yellow balloons right now. I have a feeling he should be able to defend. So, um, but I'm uh, no, don't send yellow balloons at me. Okay, that's not that's not that's not enough yellow balloons to hurt me. But um, so if I can go ahead and get this nuke sub down real fast, this shouldn't be anything for me. I can sell this guy actually. Why the heck do I still have him? But, all right. So, probably my plan here is just to go ahead and kill What? You suck against yellow balloons on this map? Come on. Uh, this is suckage. This is complete suckage. Uh, I'm going to send him a uh, bunch of pinks. So, you know what? Let's send a, send a lead first, and then a bunch of white balloons. Oh my god, it's white balloons. They're gonna be murderous. Come on. Oh, he got, he got the 1-1 one -one down, so we... He defended the leads, but I do not believe he is going to have enough. Guys, it's important to realize not just zebra rushes kill people, but also whites, blacks, they're very deadly, pinks, yellows, very deadly. So we use those to great efficiency, and we get a nice win to kick off this YouTube channel. 
So we're going to go ahead and play one more game. Um, we will not rematch him, even though he seemed like a, a decent player, even though he was using a terrible strategy. Um, actually, no, he did not seem like a decent player. He was a terrible player. Uh, no offense if you're watching this video. Uh, it's uh, there's, there's things that you can learn, right? <laughs> but, um, so, what was I saying? Okay, so I'm an accounting major, and um, again, that's what you know businesses use to figure out where their money goes. And I'm a sophomore, which means I am in the second year of college. Now, um, as I've been growing up, I've been playing a ton of strategy games, and I mean like a bunch of them. Uh, anytime I could, basically, I would play a strategy game if I, if I could get my hands on one, if I could find someone to play with. In fact, even sometimes I would play when I didn't have any friends. And so I just kind of like, say, Trouble or something, you know how it's, uh, if you know what Trouble is, that's good. If you don't, you're too young. Um, it's like basically this game where they have like a little dice in a, in a, almost like a shaking type thing and you push it down and that'll indent the metal down. Uh, and then the metal's gonna wanna pop back up to its original position. And when, when it pops back up, it throws the dice around the little, the little cage that it's in, and, and then whenever it comes down, you'll see how many that you can push forward. What? No! Come on. Um, and so I would just like, you know, I'd roll the dice for myself, then roll the dice for someone else, and someone else, and someone else, and then get back to me, and so on and so forth. So I would have fun playing that. Now, to be honest, Trouble's not exactly that deeply strategical, but that was just one example I randomly put out. Alright, so should we go with Blue Nico here? No, this guy looks like he's halfway decent. I will go with my farm strategy and teach you guys how to play this strategy. So should I go with... Uh, let's go with the Chippa. Nope, 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 Chippa. Okay, this time I'm actually going to choose my bonus. Ah! The uh, Buccaneer is actually a very good tower. Uh, you can just pop him down and sink a BFB. Alright, so, um... Okay, that's a bad placement for the tax right there. Um, I will send a couple of sets of balloons and knock out all those tacks when I'm ready to rush them. So, okay. It looks like we're going to both be doing farming, so there's going to be no, mm, you could say, mixed eco games. Um, so basically for my strat, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put down a 0, zero farm, then a zero, 0 dart, then get it up to 1, 0, my farm up to 1, 0, and then get my darts up to sharp darts. Oh, is that what they call them? Yeah, sharp darts and then razor sharp darts. Uh, get it up to zero one, and this will do most of the popping power. That's all I gotta do. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and send a couple of red balloons just so he starts leaking lives. And perfect, perfect. Oh my god. Oh, and he's putting down a ninja. Uh, now it's it's important to realize ninjas are not really the best. Um, with with farms, mainly because they are so freaking expensive. So I'm going to hang a couple lives here, that's okay, I'm fine with that. If he's going to rush me with some uh, pinks, I don't know, I'm going to send him with a few blues, which is going to be actually very deadly for him. He's going to have to boost, almost guaranteed, almost guaranteed. Um, a third tier ninja, as we just saw, I think I'll end it there. A third tier ninja, as you saw, struggled uh, against the blues, so a uh, second tier ninja has can't even hold a candle to it. So. We've already made him boost. He does have a, two, a second tier farm, that doesn't matter. We're gonna get our second tier farm before he gets his other farm going. Spent so much money on his ninja and now sub, which is a pretty good combo, I will admit. Doesn't seem like he's too far behind, but of course I do have 30 extra eco um, headed my way. However, of course, he could probably, if he was smart, actually force me to buy some more defense with uh, black sins, so I'm gonna have to be ready for that. Gonna have to be ready for that, I guess. Um, however, if he doesn't send it, I'm just gonna be greedy. Um, so I, I think basically he's just wanting this to be a farm race. I'm fine with it being a farm race. Technically speaking, I will be ahead um, just because I have better eco than him. Not by much, but as you can see, it's looks like it's added up to a few seconds now. Okay, so um, actually what I'm gonna do is I'm going to give him some serious grief. I'm gonna send a bunch of green balloons his way. This is going to be really, really bad for him. He's going to have to sell a farm. He's going to have to sell a farm. There goes the farm. There goes the airbrush darts. Perfect. And I'm going to leak a little, so I'm going to put down some darts right here. Oh, is he going to die? No way. No way. Two, one. Hey, he has died. 
one life at a time. Three, two, one. That's the first time I've ever seen that. Well, all right, guys. Uh, I think I'm going to leave it there. All right, I think I will. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video on the new YouTube channel. Um, if you did, guys, I cannot make these videos without you. So show me your support. Push that little like button below. And definitely make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you do that, guys, I will know that you are definitely on my team and I will create a lot more videos like this. So again, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Goodbye.